Hey, what's up you guys? I thought I would show you a little bit of my Saturday night go puff shift. I'm headed to drop off the third order of a triple triple delivery offer. So business has picked up. It's I'm breathing a big sigh of relief. The, the weekdays sucked bad, but the the weekend has been way better. So it looks like I'm gonna be able to continue to do gig work for a living for another season and. I'm, I'm now confident that it'll, uh, I'll eventually be able to hit the 2000 again too, so. I got three minutes till I get to the next drop off. It's an apartment. And then I'll show you what, which one's tipped out of the three. Okay, I'm at the apartment. This guy's got all alcohol in his order. So I sure hope he tips because it's a bigger hassle when you have to scan the ID and even talk to them. All right, they answered right away, and the ID scanned, and you have to have a flashlight or a second phone to be able to scan their ID when you're doing this alcohol delivery at night. Some people don't have a strong enough porch light or not a porch light at all. And so make sure you have a flashlight or a, or a second phone, even if it's a shitty phone, as long as it has the light. Okay, let's see if she tipped. Yep, she tipped, but she only tipped two bucks. Those other two deliveries were were just leave it at their door. So that's good though. Three out of three tips. Love to see that. Let's go get another one. Alright, we're pulling up to the go puff and no orders yet. Last time I I got the order like a mile away, so it must be slowing down some. There's another car there, but it looks like he's going in. Going in to get his, so I should be should be getting one soon. I'm trying for the $50 bonus, which I think I'm gonna be able to do. I've got 97 deliveries, I need 125. So I'm three away from the $40 bonus. Twenty-eight away from the full fifty bucks. So if you've never done Go Puff, Go Puff is like a gamble. You they show you the base pay and where where it's going, and you can now decline. You used to not be able to decline. You just had to take it or or not work. But now you can you can decline it if you don't. If there's one that's too far. Or, I've memorized some of the no-tip customers, so I declined the... There's regular no-tip customers, and a lot of them are in, like, million-dollar mansions, or, or two million-dollar mansions, actually, with house prices now. So, anyway, you can't... It's it's You have to accept those not getting a tip, It's and it's it's crazy. I get, like, a crazy, like, anger feeling when I hit when I get those mansion ones. I got a delivery coming in. This one's kind of far. Oh shit, I'm not doing this one. I don't go that far into Mesa. There's a GoPuff like right there that should be doing this order. At Gilbert Road and Southern, no way. So I'm declining that way too far. So they immediately sent me another order with just the far away one which is why I declined the double. Sometimes you have to just log off and come back later. I've done that. If they keep giving you the same bullshit, just go do an Uber Eats and then come back, or I go to the house and get a coffee or whatever. Look at this one, double for 25 miles. So they're still, they're not gonna, Give me the order without this one that I won't do. This is the third 
third offer with that with that one that I won't I won't go that I won't go above the 60 on GoPuff because there's a there's a GoPuff up there right there like a couple miles from the the delivery so I don't agree that we should have to go there if there's another another GoPuff warehouse right there okay here we go the guy walking in probably took that shitty one because there was other cars that pulled up that didn't go get an order so they're really trying to this one's pretty good triple eight miles did you get that one all the way in Mesa yeah Yeah, I had to decline that like four times really? yeah there's a go puff right up there I don't know why they give us those there's, there's a go puff two miles from that all right I got the triple delivery in the car just three smaller bags, so no cases of water or 12 packs of beer or cases of soda. Looks like somebody crashed. Car is sideways. It's only not even 11 yet, so people are already drunk driving, crashing, possibly. So this one's an apartment complex. This is the third one of the triple order. And there's no there's no apartment guide or map. So there's some directions from a previous driver and I, I did not enter from this where he's saying. So I'm gonna have to go to that point and then follow these directions to <clears throat> try and find this guy's unit. The customer has no notes on here. Nothing to expect you to He's got some no tip notes too. So the driver's notes saved my ass on that one. It still took forever. I, I've had to cancel these orders before when the I can't figure out the apartment complex and there's no apartment guide and the customer won't answer or help out in any way, so Let's see if this guy tipped. He had some no tip notes on his on his on the driver notes also, along with those directions. I tipped a dollar. So luckily I got a banger tip. That's what Trevor's delivery calls the good tips. Banger. I've been looking out for the deliveries moved here. He he's staying in the East Valley, so. If I spot him, I'm gonna see if he'll do a short with me. All right, finished another triple. Let's go pick up. Hopefully, hopefully we'll get another another three or four multi-order. All right, I'm back at the Go Puff. No order coming through yet. Let's see if there's other cars. There's one car. Hopefully, he's walking out with his order. in there grabbing it. Nope, he's in his car. He might be... Nope, he's waiting. I might have to wait a little bit. It's 11.22. So I still got four hours. They extended this to 3.30 a.m. is when they close it. and it's, They open right back up at 7 a.m. So I've got... I think I've got plenty of time to hit that $50 bonus. Let me show you. I'm at a hundred now. So I've made the 40. I've got the rest of tonight, four more hours. And I can do some from 7 a.m. till noon, and then I, I go to I quit at noon. And then I have all of Sunday night, you know, 9 p.m. till it closes. So shouldn't be no problem, because you get the multi-deliveries. So let's see what comes in. The other guy just got one. I should be up next. They're sending me a triple right after that guy just came out with one bag. So, I don't know why he didn't get more than one if they've already got. This isn't the greatest miles, but I'm gonna take it because it seems like we're in a little bit of a slowdown. So I'm gonna take this triple and hope that there's tips. 
So they're in bins one, three, and four. There's the one. Smaller. That's good. There's the three. Four. This one's got alcohol in it. The first one is the alcohol delivery. Four thirty. There it is, 4.30. Finally. Okay, I did that third one. So that's nine that I've showed you. That makes it nine out of nine tipped. I've been wanting to do a good go puff ride along. I've had bad luck on my previous go puffs, so I'm gonna I'm gonna end this video here. Let me show you the. I had a couple cheap tips. Um, I had a dollar and a two dollar, but every order tipped out of those three triples. It's past midnight now. I've got my bonus is just guaranteed now for the $50 bonus. 103 deliveries. Plenty of time to make that. And I've made more than I thought possible already. I'm already my total is higher than I thought that I could possibly get back on Wednesday when I did that last video. I was like thinking about what real job I should go for, <laughs> but Arizona's seasonal, it's inevitable, it has to get busier. There's no way it won't get busier because the population just starts increasing when the weather cools off. So then we have all the events and spring training and you know the golf tournament and everything that, you know, that brings all the visitors. So. Um, thanks to you guys that watched this whole video. This, my YouTube stats suck in that department. People don't even watch half of the, you know, the, most of the videos. So my YouTube pay would be way higher if I could, if I could get everybody to watch the, the total video. But I, I don't do any of the tricks that people, other channels like promise you something at the end. And I, I just do, I just show you what I'm doing and how it's going and just try to keep it real. So. But I appreciate you guys that watched the whole thing. Tune in for, on Wednesday morning for the first payday video of the season. Should be interesting to see how I start off. And that's it. Talk to you soon. We'll check in with you later. See ya.